an ASRC federal subsidiary has secured a potential $86.3 million contract to provide the Defense Counterintelligence and Security Agency with cybersecurity support services. Zage Security's government arm will provide zero-trust access control and data protection capabilities to help the U.S. Space Force ensure the security of its ground and space architectures under a $17 million contract with Space Systems Command. BAE Systems has secured a five-year contract from Lockheed Martin to continue the maintenance of the AN-ALR-94 Advanced Digital Electronic Warfare System used in the U.S. Air Force's F-22 Raptor fighter aircraft. Northrop Grumman has delivered 10 booster motor segments that will be built into NASA's Artemis II Space Launch System rocket. Sierra Space raised $290 million in equity during its Series B funding, increasing its total investment to $1.7 billion. Nokia has joined a Massachusetts technology collaborative-led effort to launch a regional innovation hub that will help the Department of Defense meet its microelectronics needs, reduce reliance on other countries for such components and mitigate supply chain risks. A coalition of experts, technologists and researchers, has been established with the aim of increasing public understanding and adoption of post-quantum cryptography. LexisNexis Risk Solutions has released its second annual report on the level and impact of fraud on the U.S. government's Supplemental Nutritional Assistance Program and Integrated Eligibility Systems, to inform agencies on the volume, cost and challenges posed by SNAP benefits fraud. Join Potomac Officers Club's Achieving Transformative Cooperation for National Defense Forum on October 24, 2023. Visit PotomacOfficersClub.com slash events. SAP National Security Services is now compliant with international traffic and arms regulation requirements for the deployment of SAP Ariba on Google Cloud's Assured Workloads platform. The U.S. space and defense business arm of Airbus has opened a new office in Denver, Colorado, its third in the state. 